I still got the Cummins, but this is the Cummins 15 Efficient Series. Um, pretty much other than that, same concept. My fuel filter um, is different. I don't like that kind. I really can't stand that kind of filter.
damn thing works. So. <clears throat> right now, we're going to ride it. Right now, we're going to ride a list. Papers and everything. All right, this is the truck. I don't like these mud flap hangers, but they're gonna stay. I'm just gonna leave them. It's greased. Got new tread, especially is good for the snow. <coughs> See that they grease it up and everything. And on both sides. I don't know why that has that on there, but. Um, Bags and there, the bags look okay. <clears throat> Has a spare tire, of course. The exhaust, I'm not gonna crawl under it yet. This is what I always have an issue with with fuel tanks. This thing always breaks off, and then this, yeah, comes up, ends up falling in too. So. Uh, the airbag so far this one for the airbag lift is still intact um, there's no damage on the body that I could see like let me show you Like there's little scratches right there. That's on the passenger side. Of course it's dirty, they don't wash them. And they got the new plastic crap. Which I guess is better than what I got now since it's, yeah. Same concept of truck and everything. It's all the same. They're just minor things different. Like this is the Cummins 15. Also, ha this crap. Look at it. It's like just bad. Well, it's not bad. That's what they do, but... You look at the truck I'm in now, I had it for four years, almost, it's damn near about 800,000 miles. It doesn't look like that. Same size alternator. Got the belts. They, th these belts are brand new because I re-looked at them. I looked at them and it shows brand new. Um, you got your coolant, same thing. So... Let's see this one. This one doesn't have disc brakes. Which is, to me, not a big deal. I started with drum, so I'm not worried about it. Um, I guess this is because it sat for so long, or for a while. Um, like there's a window on this side underneath is just like the one I'm in so I just got a you got the chains which is a good thing because this has that that I normally don't have I had it on my last truck but not on the truck I'm in now uh, like I said already look back here let's go on the inside And then this is different. You gotta lift this up in order to close it. Also, this is different to where I guess now, I don't know, same. It just looks different. Let's close it up. See, this is nice because it's clear. The one on the truck now, you get um, water going through here, so yeah. Got the def, blah, blah. You got the seats. 
everything the same this is black which is cool instead of yellow the seats are different um you still got the gauges on the steering wheel still got all the original gauges up here the only thing is the shifter is right here um, engine brake um, you do have your oil temp and your air their suspension on your drives but usually this on my truck that I'm in now this is up here and then you got your transmission tent so they took out your transmission temperature um, you got <clears throat> all this is the same um, this is a little bit more open because your shifter is usually like right here somewhere around here same concept just you don't have that the shifter right here um, you got your lights and everything you got your Qualcomm um, you got your air dump which I'm glad that this one has it since I have to get in it differential lock this one has the fifth wheel release to release your fifth wheel and then of course the slide your fifth wheel um, everything's pretty much the same um, of course you got a spot for your CD all this stuff is the same all that stuff's the same um, the fridge it is different it slides out which I can't stand the fridge like this why because I open that door and I have my drinks right here when I open it and it closes now like come on now don't get me wrong I think the freezer is taller that's about it just taller um, that's because the batteries are low I did idle it you got the table it sits like this normally and then you open it up and then boom of course you got your registration book and everything your microwave goes up here of course um, let's shut this thing up um, of course you got the mattress which I'm not gonna keep this mattress. I think I just closed my book on, or closed the hood on my book. But anyways, <clears throat> it's all the same. There's nothing new, different, nothing. You got the light, which, what not. Um, you got all your gauges, which are the same. This is to your inverter. This is your bunk heater. This is to your fridge, you turn it on. Um, clock, blah, blah, blah. You got your door locks, your top, your lights, more lights. Oh, this is, this switch, which is dumb, is for that. Um, which, that's gonna work out perfectly, because I'll tell you guys later. But, other than that, it's what it is um, the lease is up it has about it's one year and five months on this truck a year and five months so yeah um, it starts up and all that so You got the AC that comes on. Turn it on back there. Let's look back here. Turn it on. See all the all the speeds work on this back here. On the truck I'm in now, it only works on four. And that's because of the wiring and stuff underneath. Um, Yeah, that's pretty much. Oh, the seat, the seat. You see how much it wiggles? That one not as bad, but this one. Like, come on now. That's what I want them to look at and fix or see what the hell's wrong with it. Um, the glove compartment, it works because it has a handle, which mine's is broken, so. But 
other than that it's all pretty much the same and i'm gonna have to have them govern it to a different speed because i think they have it governed to 52 miles an hour which isn't gonna work so other than that yeah i want to see all right so we made it to our delivery it is 1 30. that's arizona time california time so he has two hours and 17 minutes left on this clock and we are already getting unloaded four hours early